kind of yoga poses should I do for low back pain? So this is a great question because I also suffer from low back pain. Yoga teachers are not immune to low back pain. It's, it's a universal issue and all of us sitting at our desks and in our cars and texting and being hunched over our phone, right? Low back pain is prevalent. So there are videos I have on YouTube specifically about low back pain. There's a video I have with CureJoy actually about yoga for sciatica. So we'll link those up below and you should check them out. But the poses I recommend if you don't have a herniated disc, so if you don't have a herniated or bulging disc, is I really recommend doing forward folds because forward folds are gonna help release the tension that you're feeling in your low back. Think about it. Your vertebra all day are stacked one on top of the other from you know your cervical spine all the way down. And it's really nice if you can fold forward to let the discs open and release, right? Let gravity take the, the spine in the opposite direction. So a simple forward fold, a seated forward fold, all okay to do with bent knees are really gonna help your low back pain. Twists are also really helpful for low back pain and opening up the left and right side of the low back. Twists are super detoxifying. So forward folds and twists are some of the asanas I'd recommend for low back pain. And I'd also add in that it takes time. It takes time for the low back to open up. It takes time for the low back to heal. So also be patient and maybe practice yin yoga, which again, focus on long holds to open the fascia as well as, you know, everything else that's going on. Um, yin yoga is great for low back pain. And my last tip about low back pain would be to, you know, in addition to forward folding, consider some kind of inversion therapy. I love using my yoga trapeze um, to hang upside down and literally take my spine in the opposite direction. And the yoga trapeze is great because unlike handstand, uh, or unlike headstand, excuse me, where you're putting weight on your head, with the yoga trapeze, you can just hang in, in in thin air, right? There's there's no pressure on the neck or spine. You're just using traction to to let the to, to let the low back open. So for me, also inversion therapy and hanging upside down without putting any pressure on my joints has been really great for my low back pain.